go a little bit ahead uh, compared with the uh, what the uh, we have in the Lexus schedule. Uh, I discussed it with the uh, electric schedule which was designed by Professor Gam Jung Kim next to door and uh, he uh, admitted that uh, the electric schedule that supposed to be used for teaching chapter 5 chapter 5 is a little bit too much so, uh, so um, uh, I will move on to chapter six uh, from today. Okay, so chapters. Oh, Jesus Christ! Chapter six. Distributed. The title of chapter six is distributed parameters. So reading assignment this week is of course chapter six uh, if you have some uh, extra time or if you want to go into more detail and <coughs> if you want to understand uh, deeper than what is described in this text you may read the book written by unknown people Y.H. King okay you can you can see the book that is called Introduction to Acoustics It's Fundamental Theory and Application in Korean Um Hyang Hak Kang Lectures on Acoustics If you look at that book, the first part essentially handles what we are going to learn from today until the end of the semester what do we mean by you can see you can find that book in our uh, bookstore why they call it distributed parameter system what does it mean distributed parameter system okay we learned about the vibration of a single degree of freedom system that is composed by mass, spring, and dash part. And we use one coordinate, therefore we call this a single degree of freedom system. And then we studied two degree of freedom system that simply has two maths for example like this I may say this is K1 and C1 K2 C2 Therefore, I need coordinate x1t, x2t to completely describe the motion of this kind of vibratory system. Therefore, we call it a two degree of freedom system. If we extend this, we will have
If you allow, allow me to sp spend the whole time that <coughs> supposed to be <coughs> used for this lecture, I can I can draw many 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 degrees of freedom system on blackboard, right? Say M1, M2, M3, M4, so on, so on, so on. Okay. Therefore, in this case, we need many coordinates to completely describe the system. Okay, why we do these kind of things? Why? But to understand the reason why we are studying the many degree of freedom system abroad, interesting uh, system that has many degree of freedom. Okay, many degree of freedom. Okay, we may think also that this is mass, 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 and then there's a spring dash power, spring dash power, spring dash power. Spring dash path. Okay. That might have a different stiffness and different damping ratio. C and I may say this is K N, this is K I, C I, K one, C one. When it moves due to certain excitation, this can generate, this may move like this. Okay? Depending on excitation. If you see the movement of each mass. Suppose those mass spring dash part is a, a people sitting in the Olympic study, for example. Remember when we have a big match, soccer match? What was it? In 2002. There was, I mean, Korean people may be surprised, make all the uh, people on this planet surprised very much by making a big support. What's the name of a supporter of the uh, Korean soccer team? Devil? Red Devil? Something like that. Okay, suppose there is a Red Devil in the Olympic Stadium. Okay. When they move up and down, somebody can move up, Somebody can move down, 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 up, 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 down, 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 up, 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 and down, 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 down. And what you can see? You can see certain movement. Okay, from left to right. So the mass spring dash bar system moves up and down. But what we can see is the movement of some signal from left to right that we call wave. 